Paper Mario is filmed in front of a live studio cardboard audience. Say hey there, everyone. This is Al Cow playing. Yeah, that's right. I'm playing this game here, Paper Mario. So I've been wondering. You know, previously in the game, we had this thing where I kind of aired around and was kind of a bit random and a bit going anywhere. And you're going to cross in front of a train really, really smart. <laughs> But then when proper chapter one started, oh yeah, there's also something else I want to check. Like, well, I feel like once, um, oh no, it's not. Okay, I've been wondering. Cause like, so I, like the thing I got yesterday, where is it? Uh, shrink stomp. Let's you do a shrink stomp. It works on the enemy. Mario stomps on shrinks. If it works, the enemy stomps on. See, I was wondering cause it was pink. I was like, wait. Because, like, I remember attacks being blue, but no, sometimes it can be pink. So, alright. So, that's, uh, you know what? I don't know. Hi. How's it going? So, yeah. So, uh, I'm wondering now that we're starting proper, you know, World 2, if things are indeed going to be feeling a little bit more focused and streamlined. Uh, right, you can't destroy these. I experienced one of these in the sewer, which is telling me that maybe this is where we're gonna learn how to deal with, uh, beton. I forgot what that is in English. It's fine. Uh, where could it be? Whoa, ho, ho. Zoom in. Hey, it's the male, male guy. Hey, male Koopa, you got a hat and everything. Aviator helmet. Hat cap? I don't know. Gotta keep bugs out of his eyes while he's flying at high speed. Like, that makes sense. Huh. Well, yeah, you sure did that. Hi. Just, I'm pretty sure we spoke before, buddy. Para carry. The letter is deliverer. Well, letter perfect. Mm hmm. I hang a bit of trouble with a lost letter. All right. Well, you know, I dropped it on Mount Rugged. Well, that's terrible, buddy. Like, that's just kind of outright very bad. <laughs> the way with words. <laughs> Okay, so I'm uh, so, so thoroughly. So if I find a letter, consider bringing it back to Paracarry while we're on Mount Rugged. Sounds good. You can't tell where we are, right? I give it. Yeah, no. Right now we're on Mount Rugged, the Mount made of rugs. Oh, that's a Sonic ramp. <laughs> Can you go up that? We. All right. Well, that's fun. There's a little hole there to mount in the rocks. If you feel like rock holding. Okay, so here's like, hey, if you see one of these, you press the button, then you go, and then it just kind of happens. Feels like there might be more of these going forward, so look forward to it. Oh, mole. Uh, there we go. Destroy mole. We got, we got Monty Mole here going on, so let's fight a Monty Mole. Land on it. Yeah, so keep bopping. Then he's dead. They will not last long. That's great. So yeah, enemies here are weaker than the enemies I fought in the... That's a rock. Are weaker than the enemies I fought in the sewer, which confirms my thought that I was there a little bit earlier than intended, perhaps. Level up! So level up. I told, I told myself I level up my firepower. So I'm doing that. So now... Um, whoa, I can be- I can more effectively use stuff? Like, that's the dream. So there's an up path, there's a down path. Up path leads to another path, but what about down path? Down path leads to an ambush! That's right, I made the first strike. Alright, it's just more of these now. Well, okay, we'll keep this in. Maybe having more moles will make this more different? I can't see how that would be the case, but... It looks like they have like three health. Oh, I didn't block that. Ah, I blocked that one. Truly, the world is full of cheese. So I think they have three health. Because I popped on one, it would did two damage. And then I immediately killed it. So. Yeah, that's the feeling. Yeah, it's just like. Just enough to be awkward. But when you block their rocks, like, like, okay, like, I did that on purpose. Yeah, so three health. There you go. So you don't need Goombario to know their health. You can use math. Just use mathematics. That is why that was invented. Hey, sleepy sheep! 
Rock, rock, rock. All right, glad we had this conversation. Get out of here, yellow block. Look at this cute thing. I saw you in Toad Strikes. Waka. Uh huh. Wackadoo. Wackadoo. Wackoo. Well, you're fun. You're a fun little otter. You say that always the same thing? Yeah. Well, you're adorable. I feel like the game wants, like, though, know, with his name being Wacka, gonna whack him or something, right? I feel like that's what they want. I don't, it's cute. It's adorable. I'm not, I'm not hitting him. Maybe something's gonna happen if, I don't care. I'm not hitting him until I have an extremely good reason. And uh, I don't have one right now, and I saved it. So, oh, you can't go up here. For a second there, I thought I was jutting out, but it's not. It's actually linked to something else here, to a mountainside that doesn't exist, actually. It's pretty good. But maybe that's gonna be a return trip, because there's a slide hill there. Oh, there, buddy. You're being all menacing, popping out and throwing rocks? Yeah, of course you are. Adorable. Yeah, three, three health. Oh, wait, are there like an infinite of them? How much does recover heal again? Like, it recovers, uh... You know, I'm thinking multi-bounce would probably be better. Like, I do everyone one damage, and then going forward, everyone just takes one more hit. Uh, I don't know. Maybe that would make sense. Alright, well, I am going to use Recover here for healing, refresh, whatever. Because this is a resource that, like, goes up. Like, you know, like, it's a resource that will passively rise back up. It's not like a mushroom or something, where if I use it, it's gone. I think that's just the smart thing to do. And, uh, yeah, whoops, sorry. And, uh, you know what? Yeah, let's, uh, focus here. Just do that, because... I think Bombat can just destroy the next slightly charge, but that's enough for me. I'm not sure, actually. I might have, uh, messed that one up. Yeah, I had not done any damage to him. Well, I know what, that's fine. There we go. Do it again. Focus again. Get that healing meter back up. There we go. See, already we're back to being able to heal for free. And uh, that makes me pretty happy. Bombat is pretty reliable and being able to get rid of moles. Uh, that just seemed like... Un until I get like a healing spell of some kind. That just feels like the most reliable way of getting things done. So yeah, I'm here. Yeah. Oh, shoot. I'm the one I got hit in the face. And I didn't block. Pretty good. Yeah, so here's my theory. Now everyone is one hit away from death. So, yeah, I'm gonna end things next turn. So, yeah, this is the most efficient way of, um... getting this done. But you're already kind of at the border of life and death. So I'm gonna be doing that instead. So, you know, assuming I had blocked better, that would have been the way to get things done. But I messed it up, so it's fine. It's fine, don't worry about it. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, she's so happy. Alright, didn't drop any hearts, that's fine. Where are we and what am I doing? Good question. I'm gonna- wait, how am I- okay. Whoa, he was in the air, but I was even more in the air. That's right. Uh, yeah. So, I've got stuff. You stuff. No, wait, you can... You can't attack behind. That was a waste, actually. Ah, eh, well. It's fine. I've been wondering, like, I'm kind of... Well, my bar didn't raise there. Hmm. So, there's a letter, by the way. That's the letter. No, yeah, there's a thing about a letter, and a uh, whoop, and I can fall off all day long. I can do that. But, like, so, like, you're gonna be able to get this. Whoop, there you go. 
But I can't cross over. Eh. Can't do like a shell jump. But clearly there's a hammer there. Hammers can be fun. It can be. But you gotta be careful. I don't know what I'm saying here at this point. That's okay. Alright. Uh, wrong button. That happens. There we go. I just... Hammers are not reliable as an attack method for me. They just are not, even if they're supposed to be really easy. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter what you think. Alright, hey, I got found a letter. I don't know if it's the letter, but it is a letter. It is one letter. I'm so relieved. Oh, what? You could have told me that. Like, you just. You would have saved me probably a trip. I wouldn't have come back. You, uh, I mean, whatever. It's fine. I get it. Your pride as a male person is at stakes. Whatevs. Oh, Mole is back. Uh, fought that Mole before. Yeah, all the Moles are already back. Like, I didn't think it would take so not long for them to respawn. Alright, you know what? These, they're still worth stuff, so this is probably worth doing. If you want to be hyper-efficient, do this. And then explode the other one, and then I'm sure not to take any damage. Like, I just got more FP, might as well use it. And you know, look at that, I still have like a ton of flowers. And, like, enemies kind of drop flowers, like, frequently or going inside a mine here. So, I feel like, you know, it's kind of a waste when... That's right. I thought you were... Ding. Ding, huh? Let's see what's another hammer. Yeah, just a big old ding. What if I blow you up? Uh, what if we just used high explosives? Oh, you didn't like that! Anyway, point is... When I receive, uh, stars... Flowers... Every time I receive a flower after a fight, and I can't put it... And I can't use it... That is... Oh, there's another bulb... Yeah, I'm, we're totally gonna have the ability to cross pets at some point. Like, that is... Pretty clear. I'm gonna heal my meaner, since it's just, like, not charging, apparently. There you go. Since Bombat can take care of the rest of the fight, right here. But yeah, so I made my point, use flowers, because otherwise you waste flowers when you receive flowers that you can't add to your flowers. See, these would have been wasted. Yeah, so it is increasingly clear that someone will have the ability to do something about me going places at some point. Oh no, wait, you're full of spikes, that's a bad idea. Yeah, 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 that was a, a bad call there. So you can't do anything, really? Well, okay, let's try D-Pound Down. So that's like an armor piercer. Still just, well, only those two, but two is all you need, so alright, good to know. Yeah, so, weapons that have the ability to pierce armor. Something you kinda need, like it's something you have to consider having with you. Oh, my money's falling all over, and it's flashing now. Flashing money! That's how you end up falling off money. <laughs> That's not money, I'm not falling off money, I'm falling off the path. I don't know why I'm going here, like I can't cross there, I can't kick there. I will have, at some point, the ability to cross gaps, and there's nothing you can do about it. I- I sought you out of there, like, I did that on purpose. I was like, you know what, I'm gonna cause problems. Oh shoot! I almost messed it up. <laughs> I almost held instead of tap. Her two attacks use very different ideas, very different concepts. Basically the opposite concepts of one another. Oh, you got hit in the rock. Well, you know what, I can use a refresh, if only to restore my flower points. Again, like, and it's fine, because I- one attack of either will will destroy that mole, so this is fine. This is a uh, this is neat. It's like I feel like I'm using that old man summon a lot, but it's there to be used, right? Like use it. Go ahead and use it. It's 
fun. And here's a little cave zone. Check it out, now we're out of the cave zone. Here's a trombone. Can I fall off? I can't fall off. Just jump over those tiny rocks, Mario. That cannot be difficult. All right, too hard for Mario. So, but wait a second. But is there not also a path here? Oh, there's two pathways. The map, I don't know why I'm looking at the map. This will not help me. <laughs> uh, okay, let's just peek. This leads to... Well, I just, I just did that. But hey, I found the ladder! But I just did that. Whoa, that rock is angry. Alright, can't look around there. Aha! You were ambushed! Alright, time for us to be serious. So, here we go. Pow. See, I messed it up because it's hard. Fine. Well, that's a big old waste of uh, FP, though. Like, that is just like a huge waste. Alright, so that's a stone attack. So, you know, we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna focus because I can't refresh. And I'm gonna need to use the super soon. But in the meanwhile, I have just enough to blow this man up. And he's gone! Spinning around on his foot. Now he's dead. Forever. Alright, I ain't gonna hurt that. That's fine. So it's a good thing I fell down here, actually. Yeah, this is extremely made with the idea that you fell down here. Yeah, so I think we're gonna have the ability to fly sooner rather than later. It is getting fairly unethical, but also unsubtle. Both <laughs> that we're gonna have that kind of ability. Well, I found one letter, and I found this fun slide that made me do a fun jump. Uh, all right, get out of here, rock. That's right. But like, you don't flip them off or something, you know, which would be useful. All right, so oh, I don't have any left. This is a problem. Okay, uh, I have to eat a turn here. Everyone's gonna get a free attack in. I just can't see what else to do. So do nothing. We're gonna have to block everything. Wow, I... Things are coming right at me. Alright, okay. So, do a little bit of refresh. That's just... That's what you're doing now, Mario. I'm sorry. You're now White Mage. <laughs> just summoning friends and help and things all along. You are going to be the one that... It's called a cleft. That's going to enable me to do the things that I want to do. Because, yeah, see, like, I'm looking at this here. Like, but I want, like, yeah, like... It's good to have some spare FP to heal, but I need more than two. You know, I have plans, you know, that I want to accomplish. And, uh, oh boy. You know what, that's fine. Go ahead and hurt me all along. That's okay. So now you're gonna focus again. Next turn over, you're gonna refresh, you're gonna heal the damage, or at least most of it, and you're gonna heal stars to be a little bit closer to being usable. So it's a bit of an awkward little turn, but I think it's an okay one. That was way too early, I thought. Summon the old man! This is full-time old man bickoner now. That's what you are, Mario. Accept your fate. <laughs> so we're gonna body slam him. I forget if he's like close to dying or not. All right, one last throw rock. There we go. Block a little bit. But see, now we get opportunities for all kinds of healing. Now you know, if hearts drop, if flowers drop, nothing gets wasted. Use every part of the buffalo when you stomp on it to death. And you see, look at that. Everything falls here and it feels great. We did it. So there's a downslide, and we can slide down, but there's a ladder. Gonna get a ladder to the Paracoopa. And he's gonna reward us with mollusks. Weird. Alright, you can go ahead and damage this guy in the back. And then we're gonna blow up the Rock Man. So... 
yeah, no, yeah, like you kind of just have to use her here for this purpose, and then he's gonna throw it, uh, whatever. He's all already on the verge of death, so we use this turn to focus. You know, it's always the, 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 the player characters act first, and then it's the enemy's turn to attack. Like, there's a very, very specific order of things. And there we go. So yeah, every time... Yeah, it's uh, it's an every time type of thing now at this point. You know, every time. Alright, nothing in this bush. Hey, big mushroom is good. There you go. It's not really, it's mushroom. It's big to me. It looks pretty, like, you know, like in terms of like sheer mushroom size. It's a big one. Okay, so you just got bot, which is great because that means I can bot you again, destroy you. And that will clear the way for a certain bomb to just march on over and obliterate out of existence. A lot of screen shake today. <laughs> Every time the world blows up, the world shakes a little bit. I was hoping for flower drops, not gonna lie. The thing behind here? Like, what's going on here? Ooh, 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 mysterious cave. Well, I'm pressing, like, interact. As much as I can. Uh -huh, uh -huh. That's a true hidden gem of Mount Rugged. I'm trying to open this chest, but it is not working. I just can't stop hopping. Damage dodge. If you do action commands, decreases Mario damage by one. Okay, so it's a better dodge. That's a better dodge. That seems great. Actually, actually does it tell me what it is? It's three, though. What am I willing to sacrifice that's worth three? Because everything here is pretty good. I don't really rely on this, but that's just one. Well... Hmm... No. This is the one that makes me go, yeah, but this I don't really use. And, uh, see, all of these have relevance, but maybe not you for now. I want to try that. Because, yeah, that is adding more dodge. But I want, yeah, I want far spin, though. Like, if I can just, oh, there's money there, and yeah, it's tempting to get, but this is a really high flight. Yo, check it! Alright, I mean, there was one with, like, you bought one, and one you bought, like, a hundred, oh, shoot. Uh... Well, all right, I, I actually got hurt first by Clef. Yo, I took nothing! It's beautiful. It worked! Focus! Blocking two is such a major thing. It is, like, absolutely ridiculous. See there, because normally they do damage. But if I, if I ever nailed it, which I am not, would take no damage. <laughs> Which I am not indeed. Uh, I'm starting to feel like even next level up, I might want to boost up my flower power because I'm still always running out of fire, you know, flower points, and it's kind of extremely useful for me. It turns out. Why am I keep missing though? I don't know. I just am. I, I just am. <laughs> They have a little bit of a weird timing, maybe. Maybe. But yeah, like, I guess if you're not just summoning old man around all day long, I guess maybe the expected strat is to be consuming mana restoring objects all day long, like this honey syrup, for example. Well, I hit it a few times. I'm gonna hit this one too. So I do have honey. Considering putting that in my stomach. Yeah, there's coins and stuff there, but we will be returning once I have the ability to conquer gravity. There's a letter, letter number three to Colorado. That one specifically. Yeah, this didn't have like rocks on the side. Okay, yeah, I see where we are. Shit. Oh, well, okay, I'm right here and there's no enemies. So let's check out some of that ground money, money on the floor. Come on, let's go put money on the floor. Yeah, I can't go over there, and there's even like a shard. Uh, have I? Okay, no, I haven't been here before. Oh, shoot. Well, I made a first try, but I'm gonna land on the spike. 
That's not, you don't want that. All right, focus some more. So maybe this would have been a good time for, for indulging in honey, honestly. Cause you just, well, I'll just body slam you anyways, cause it's fun. But yeah, see, like they have two armor, which is exactly the amount of damage most of the people do. Pretty wild. And I don't know why, why, why the timing with their attacks here is not like I did it at first. I did not have any problems. Something at some point, somewhere. Changed. Oh shoot! I messed up. That was enough though. <laughs> but I messed up. I was not tapping enough. Take the money. Money's good. But yeah, there's the real prize. As well as that like, little hammery badge we saw. And other things. I wonder, though, if the protection badge that I'm wearing... If maybe it makes the timing harder? Like, it's not impossible. It's not impossible. I did not figure that out. Right, I know where we are. We are actually within spitting distance. The paracarry. So we're just gonna go and deliver the letters that he lost straight away. Alright, you know what? There's a mole there, I guess. It's pretty spooky. You know, it jumped up and has shades. Spooky shades! Alright, you. What's your deal? Here's a ladder. There you go. Uh-huh. I can't give you both of them at the same time. No, yeah, like, I have it in my pockets and everything. And I could just give it to you. I would have handed both of them at the same time. Alright, it's fine. What have you lost from marbles? Oh, cool. You're terrible at your job, it turns out. <laughs> if you're in an RPG and someone offers to help, you take it. Oh, that kind of help. I thought it would be like a menu of some kind. Like, delivering items or something. Hey, look at that! And he can para-carry me over pits! Oh, well, that was pretty transparent. Can also attack with skydive or smash into enemies with a shell shot. Uh, can you blow things up? If you want to deliver a letter to someone, just speak to that person. Have to be next to you. So you also have the ability to mail things with you around. All right, so, but yeah, like, for, are you able to handle living rocks that have high defense? Like, that's sort of like my main concern right now. Do I want to be down here? I mean, I can be down here. They leave very recognizable hole shapes in the surface of walls, and that makes me happy. Next time, we're basically going to be scouring the exact same place we were at, but this time with a flying buddy who will help us fly. 